This is a smart manufacturing system that makes toy cell phones. We did research on it to examine the types of unconventional attacks that could be launched on smart manufacturing systems. This smart manufacturing system is completely modular. It consists of seven stations, each containing a programmable logic controller, or PLC, a human machine interface, or HMI, and the physical machine that does the actual work, such as a robot. In this research scenario, the robot arm is not working properly. Even though there are safety limits to the machines to prevent damage in case of malfunctions, the robot arm suddenly falls near the conveyor belt. How did this happen? Let's begin by checking the Manufacturing Execution System, or MES, and seeing how the production process is running. At first glance, the operation seems to be running normally. The production order shows that all phone cases should get drilled on the right side. But how come this case has a hole that has been drilled on the left side? Data may have been mangled on the MES. Let's inspect the HMI to find out. The HMI is not responding and is unable to communicate with the MES. It appears that there's an attacker on the network, who is spoofing address resolution protocol or ARP packets and keeping the network down. But the whole system was designed to be completely isolated, and an attacker shouldn't have been able to get in. It's possible that rogue software has been downloaded to the engineering workstation. But no, there's just an industrial add-in for the robotics development environment. This add-in comes from the vendor's app store, so it's presumably safe. Industrial app stores such as this have been gaining traction. However, we've found that not all of the add-ins in the app store are vetted properly. For example, this add-in is apparently for research purposes only, and has no actual functions. But it was added to the app store nonetheless. During our research, we found and reported a vulnerability in the App Store. Before the flaw was fixed, it was possible to bypass the vetting process. As a result, the add-in was immediately available for download. Now, it has complete control of the engineering workstation. However, upon checking the network logs, we see that the engineering workstation isn't performing any spoofing. The attacker may have compromised the development workstation, or the repository of an open source project library to trojanize the custom industrial Internet of Things, or IIoT device in this factory, that's used, for temperature sensing and anomaly detection. Looking at the code of the firmware though, we don't see anything suspicious. The code is just reading from the temperature sensor using the driver. It's possible that the ARP spoofing code is hidden in a trojanized library instead. This explains why the HMI got disconnected from the network and the MES. It also explains the unusual temperature readings that have been triggering emergency stops. But what about the robot? It's protected by a password. This means that an attacker would still need the password to gain access to the robot. During our research, we found and reported a vulnerable mobile HMI app. This mobile HMI exposed sensitive authentication information that could allow an attacker to reverse engineer the credentials stored in it. The attacker would then know the password to the robot and be able to send movement commands to it. The attacker, having gained access to the engineering workstation, may have used vulnerable or malicious automation logic to send unintended movement commands to the robot or install a back door to control the robot from the network. With our research, we emphasize that since all of the machines in a smart manufacturing system are on the same flat network, they are isolated from the outside world, but not from one another. This gives rise to a complex ecosystem that has repercussions on the types of attacks that are possible in smart manufacturing systems. For more details and insights on these attacks, visit www.trendmicro.com and read our research Attacks on Smart Manufacturing Systems, a forward-looking security analysis.